Detective Ryan and Doc Hudson, I'd like you to meet my friend Claire. She's the pharmacist I was chatting to you about, who's done wonders for my allergies. Hi. It's complicated, Judge Connor. I spoke to her the other night and she knows the code and she just straight out told me. I don't care who she is, but she has to be stopped and what she prepares. I don't care. But when Joseph hears, we'll be held accountable for that vault. Yes, that vault. All that matters to you is no right sharing confidential information. Leave it with me. Ask us. I just need to grab another bottle of those magic tablets for full spray. Otherwise, you know my allergies go to berserk. Sure, sure, Erica. Actually, I brought a bottle with me tonight, as I'll be away for the next few months in Africa on safari. It should keep you going till I get back. I hope it will be enough. I have that big conference coming up and... Look, if you get stuff, the key to my office next door is just under the dog statue. You'll find what you need in there. But don't worry, Erica. What's the worst that could happen? Mum, you know how I feel about all of this. The boys, your grandkids, school fees are only going up every year. Well, I'm not sure what you expect me to do about it. It's the choices you make, son. You want everything. But quite frankly, you have to work for it. For the lovely massage and facial package, the winner is Detective Ryan. <laughs> Eric's on the floor, just out cold! I am Rebecca Lee, and this is and this is Constable Rachel McGrath from the local police station. So what's going on here? So don't you think we should clear the scene? Yes. Um, Everybody, out! Be sure no one leaves. They are all suspects. On quick inspection of the body, it sh seems she has been poisoned. I'll need to run some lab tests to find out what it is. It shouldn't take long. So you would be the next of kin. And you have no idea of who may have wanted your mother dead? Curious. Detective, Mr. Simmons always complained of not being left enough money. I know they had an argument at the party. I see, but I actually think Erica was very angry with you over the phone. Well, yes, but, but she's on medication from Claire and I thought she was over her allergies. A simple mistake, nothing that would kill her. Doc, I don't know who would have wanted her dead, but we need to find out. I'm concerned with what I found. You could shed some light, I'm sure. There seems to be poison in her system. Perhaps we could run some more tests? I heard the judge talking with the young woman about Erica and her health. Why was he concerned with her health? They barely knew each other. Good morning, Judge Corporal. We have a search warrant for your home. May we come in? Uh, no. Just out here, but what is this all about? I've seen this somewhere before, Judge Connell. What is it? Ah, oh, yes, the Illuminati. I was unaware, Judge Connell, that you were a follower. I hear that Erica was too. Did you two attend meetings together? Well, no. We were acquaintances, and of course I supported her fundraising effort. But that is all. In fact, I don't recall knowing she was part of the Illuminati. So, could you tell me a little about what you believe? Right, so the bug's been planted. We just need to listen in. Shh! He's talking with someone now. Well, uh, yes, I was searching here. I hope this can't be traced to me. Are you sure nobody saw me leaving the pharmacist's office? Mm. Well, you are my accomplice. I, w accomplice. I won't hesitate to point fingers. Let's make sure you covered your tracks because I, the head of the Illuminati won't be happy if this leads to him. Joseph is a very vindictive man. That was a lucky break. All evidence was pointing to you. Lucky the detective and Mary heard ju the judge revealing his dirty secret. I'm curious, what did Erica do that made her a target? She knew the vault code to the Illuminati which gave her access to all members of the secret club. The arrests are just beginning. I'm curious to see who else is part of this secret group too. Erica did have a lot of friends. It's curious that none of us were part of this secret group.